my dad played for the University of Maine, and uh, he's a rink owner, so it was pretty uh, obvious at a young age I was going to be a hockey player. You know, I played for my local teams in New York, and the NTDP recruited me. And I came out and visited the facilities, and uh, you know, the town was beautiful, and I really liked the coaching staff and everything, so it was a really big turnout for me. team is just the best in the country um, at developing players. I've seen the success that a lot of good players have had coming out of here, so it was kind of a no-brainer for me to come out here and play. They were really excited for me. They were very supportive. They knew it had been a long-time goal of mine, so um, they were very cool with uh, me making the transition out here. hang out pretty much every day at school, at the rink obviously, and after practice we go out to eat or you know, we hang out and do stuff. So you really form a bond with your teammates and um, they're almost brothers at this point, having been together for two years. It was just weird being away from my parents and being at a new school was kind of a tough transition, but uh, you know, my family supported me and you know, it was they made it a lot easier. They're very serious about schoolwork and our attendance and keeping up our good grades. But uh, at the end of the day, I want to be a hockey player, and that's very important to me. Uh, just hard work and determination, just willing to, you know, put in the time and, you know, just working at it. I mean, Rome wasn't built in a day. It's, it's a process. Anything you do is um, it's going to take time and effort. It's important to have a good support group that's going to help you along the way.